tonight, the man in charge of Center Township's finances for a decade is now the focus of a state audit. The state board of accounts says the township overpaid Al Meisen more than $170,000 in taxpayer money. Call 6 investigator Kara Kinney has been digging into the audit all day. She joins us in the newsroom with what she's uncovered. Kara? Well, Erica, according to this audit, Center Township CFO Al Meisen was a salaried employee but received more than $95,000 in overtime over a six year period. The audit also shows Meisen sometimes reported working 22 hour days on the weekends. Some government watchdog groups aren't buying it. The heart of Marion County is Center Township, a place where many people are in need, like Michael Nichols, who came to the trustee's office for help. This is my last option, you know, to, to pay bills, to, to, you know, keep going. An audit just released by the State Board of Accounts shows in 2010, Township CFO Al Meisen earned a base salary of $92,000, $52,000 in comp time, $22,000 in overtime, and $6,000 in paid time off for a total of $173,000. Auditors question whether Meisen was entitled to receive such compensation per the township's own policies. They listed more than 500 days from 2005 to 2010 where Meisen worked, quote, excessive hours, 17, 18, even 22 hours a day on the weekends. Did he really? I don't know, but I kind of doubt it. Mark Lawrence is with the Indiana Chamber of Commerce, which has called for more oversight in township government. Well, when I saw this audit and read through it, I was really shocked. Al Meisen left the trustee's office last year, months after trustee Eugene Akers was elected. The former CFO wasn't home, but in a statement to the state said, quote, All compensation received was valid and earned in service to Center Township, and that compensation was in compliance with my employment agreement, the policy handbook, the accounting manual, state and federal regulations. As for oversight, auditors say Meisen's timesheets were not reviewed or approved by three trustees throughout his employment, Carl Drummer, William Douglas, and current trustee Eugene Akers. Is it realistic that a CFO in a township would work 22 hours a day? Not to. Well, yeah, I've worked a 22-hour day, but I've slept for 48 hours after that. <laughs> Trustee Akers says his administration requested the special audit of Al Meisen. I wasn't going to sign up on something that I'd be responsible for. We could not reach former trustee William Douglas and former trustee Carl Drummer declined to comment, but in comments to the state asked the State Board of Accounts not to publish the audit, saying it would damage his reputation and do a disservice to public servants. If you'd like to read this audit as well as the full response from Al Meisen and Carl Drummer, you can go to our website, theindiechannel.com. Kara auditors question $170,000 worth of cost. Will the former CEO have to pay that money back? Well, that's unclear at this point. State auditors forwarded the audit to the, to the prosecutor's office and the attorney general's office, who will decide if criminal charges or a civil lawsuit is warranted.